Students at an Upland Elementary School are upset after getting racist drawings from their classmates. Now their parents are demanding answers. It is not the first time the Upland Unified School District has experienced this type of racism, but parents hope it will be the last. KTLA Shelby Nelson is live in Upland with a story you'll see only on five. Shelby. Yeah, sure, Micah. These parents are frustrated. They are angry, understandably. And one parent tells me that his child specifically has repeatedly been taunted and called monkey. Now, we do want to warn you, some of these drawings and images are uh, offensive to some. It almost doesn't seem real, just that it's that blatant, and I think that's what's the most scary. They're images that are sending shockwaves through the Upland Unified School District. A series of racist drawings one sixth grader allegedly gave to a fellow black student, one of them saying, you're my favorite monkey, and another to my favorite cotton picker. The mother of the student who received them telling KTLA she has since pulled her daughter from school after continued harassment by students. Another family, parents may Lana and Rome Douglas have three kids attending the same school. They said they were going to give her one that specifically said, you're my favorite slave, and they were going to show her as a slave hanging from the tree. The Douglases say that a group of girls claimed they'd give their daughter back rubs and massages, saying, It's Black History Month. It's your month, so you're entitled to back rubs. And apparently someone told her, well, maybe only half the month because you're only half black. I want to make it perfectly clear that we have a strict zero tolerance policy on any type of hate speech, harassment. The district uploaded a video to YouTube on the recent matter one day after the principal of Pepper Tree sent out a letter to parents, but that came two weeks after the incident actually happened. I'm hoping that the district does not brush this under the rug as they brushed issues under the rug in the past. PTA president at the school, Robin Allen, says families demand answers. We want to know what zero tolerance policy means. This is not the first time a situation like this has happened. It's not going to be the last time that the situation happens. But the most important thing is our response to the situation. Parents, I just think that it's important to advocate for your kids as much as you can um, because they spend so much time at school. Um, you have to be there. And the Upland Unified School District provided a statement saying in part an investigation took place immediately upon learning about these disgusting racist drawings. We asked whether the students who created the pictures will be disciplined, but the district went on to say that privacy laws prevent them from sharing that information. Now back out here live, we do know that a board meeting will be happening tomorrow and parents say they will be there to bring this matter up to the board. Reporting live in Upland, I'm Shelby Nelson, KTLA 5 News. All right, Shelby, thank you. Now